And I said, we were right. Listen to this. I told you so. Trump reels off a list of times liberal media said he was wrong when he was right all along. From Wuhan to Hunter Biden's laptop and the clearing of Lafayette Square. Welcome to the Dum Dum News Channel dedicated to reviewing and discussing news stories from around the world. Help me trigger the YouTube algorithm by pressing the thumbs up button, subscribing to my channel, leaving a comment, and sharing with someone you think would like this content. Sources will be linked in the description so you can read the full details yourself. Today is Sunday, so one, you get to hear my voice. And two, I'm pretty tired from installing insulation in houses all week, so I'm going to keep it short. I've done videos on many things he mentioned, and I highly recommend you go and watch them. But I just put out a, uh, a statement, and I said, we were right, listen to this, on the hydroxychloroquine, and it works. You saw the reports just came out. The virus came from the Chinese lab, the China virus. Hunter Biden's laptop was real. They tried to say, well, it was made by Russia. Russia, Russia, Russia. Uh, Hunter Biden's laptop was real. Lafayette Square was not cleared for a photo op. That just came out, and I want to thank the Inspector General for having the courage to come out with the truth. They were saying Lafayette Square was a big deal. By the way, they tried to burn down these insurrectionists. They tried to burn down the church, which was built at the same time as the White House, and they almost got it. Interestingly, they did fireproofing work a week before. If they didn't do that fire, it was luck. Well, maybe it was from God. If they didn't do that fireproofing work, the church would have been burned down. Uh, the Russian bounty story was a fake. Remember that? The Russian bounty. It was a total fake. We did not produce, and, and think of this, the vaccines, all of the vaccines were saving. Frankly, I believe in freedom. You have to make your own choice. But the vaccines are saving not only the country, they're saving the world. This would be another 1917, where you lost almost 100 million people with the Spanish flu. So the vaccines, and we did it in less than nine months. Everybody said it was going to take three, four. Dr. Fauci, your favorite person, said it would take three, four, five years. Don't even do it because it's going to take so long. The FDA does not like me very much, that I can tell you. They don't like me even a little bit because I pushed them like they've never been pushed. It was supposed to take three to five years. I got it done in less than nine months. So the vaccine's big deal. That's a really big deal. And then we bought billions of dollars before we knew it even worked. Otherwise, you wouldn't have had the vaccine till October of this year. So nobody, all of the people that have been able to get their shots, nobody, nobody would have had it yet. But remember, it's in my opinion, if you look back at what transpired over the last few years, you will clearly see that mainstream media and big tech turned him into a monster. It became popular to say things like F Trump and very unpopular to back him. They also censored him and many others that wanted to speak out. Even doctors that wanted to help were censored. I believe that suppression of information like Hunter's laptop and medication that actually work has had negative consequences for us all. Regardless of him being right or wrong, being silenced for unpopular or different views is something that we should fight against because we should have all the information available so we can make the best decisions possible. Those are my thoughts. What are yours? Leave them in the comments below. Please share this video for education and awareness. For the Dum Dum News Channel, I'm Dum Dum.